Hello YouTube, this is John. This video I'm going to quickly show you how to solve this problem that you see here. When you try to go to the recovery system to recover your computer, you get this error that shows in this color gray. And yet this side, to make it work very well, you have task to be showing like these other options. Like in case you want to back up, this will allow. And you can also go back. But in our case here, we want to restore our system, but we get this error that you see right here. So to solve this error, I want you to go ahead and follow the instruction I'm going to give you. So what you're going to do to resolve this is very simple. You're going to click this side and reboot the system. So the system will reboot. Uh, this is an HP laptop. This is an HP Pavilion laptop. So we're having an issue. We are trying to restore it, but we get some problems to go to the recovery part. So in this video, I'm going to show you that uh, it's very easy to restore this. If you see the recovery partition in your computer. So right now I'm going to pause the video so that the computer reboots very well and opens to where we need it. Uh, then I'll proceed. So you have to make it go and open. So that goes to the recovery part of it. Then I'm going to pause. So right now I have my computer opening. The, it's loading. And what happens here, you're going to wait for it to fully open. And then we proceed with the, our procedure of making our solving that, that error that doesn't allow us to install uh, to do the, fact, the recovery mode i'm going to pause again now our computer has opened so this computer has problems with loading it's very slow so to resolve this issue we are going to go to this pc this pc Sorry about the shaking, I'm holding this myself. Oh, it's a bit slow, that's why I'm going to factory set it. But I've got that error, but I know how to resolve it. So when you reach here, you're going to go and see this folder. But make it here, they, these people have tried, the, the users, they have put some things on it and they accidentally renamed it actually i've created that error because on the previous pc they have renamed this recovery file that's why it won't allow to work as we want it to do so so what you're going to do if you have it there and it has been given another name you're going to click rename rename you don't delete it you click rename and leave it as recovery then click enter and then leave it like that so this will solve our problem so what i'm going to do next i'm going to go ahead and uh and shut down the pc shut down then next step here i'm going to pause the video for that uh, shutting down completes then we shall come back on how to go into the recovery mode itself so our computer has now gone off then i'm going to click the power key to turn it on then i'll click f11 so that we go to the recovery system mode then i'll wait for it to load then you're going to follow the steps the one that you go through to go to the recovery so you have to wait for it then to load the files then after to open so this is an hp pavilion laptop it's core i5 7 generation and this is how you do it uh, then when you reach here hope you see very well when you reach here i want you to go to troubleshoot so when you go to troubleshoot, I want you to go to recovery manager 
And when you go to recovery manager, it will load the files and then our system is now not complaining. It is now working very well. It is good to go. And this is how we do the process of how to fix that error. As you can see, it's working the same as the other options. So when I click on it, I'll be able to proceed to other recovery settings. So if this video is helpful, please subscribe to this channel, click the bell icon, not that get notified if I upload this full video like this. I'm going to proceed with my recovery op options right now. So thanks for watching. Have a nice time. Goodbye.